Daniel, who entered the lion's den, had nothing on Captain Angler, superintendent of Chessington Zoo. He's off in search of a litter of wolf cubs, and that's something the rest of their family don't like. The only thing that'll entice mother and father away from their children is a good square meal. Dig, brother, dig is the order of the day for the keepers. Somewhere under the ground, there's the litter of cubs, seven of them, and they've made their home in a tunnel down there. You know what London's underground system's like? Well, this is twice as complicated, and there aren't any route maps to help you. The tunnels are many yards long and cross and intercross. Four hours of digging and the search is over. The cubs are a bit camera shy at first, but they'll have to get used to people staring. It looks as if they'll be one of the main attractions at Chessington Zoo for quite a time, and babies always draw a crowd. A quick checkup to find out if they're boys or girls, then onto the scales for the weigh-in. A very strict watch will be kept on them from now on, as they're the first wolf litter ever to be born at Chessington. If you think they're as gentle as puppies, the keepers will tell you different, and they've got scars to prove it. Although they weigh only four or five pounds each, they have teeth like needles. So look out, Mum, you've got some tough kids on your hands.